Alright guys, this is a YouTube video tutorial on how to get the mouse pointer slash cursor from Need for Speed World to use for your own personal use on your computer. Alright, let's start off. So, to get to the cursors, what we must first do is open up our libraries. Now if you've gotten here, we're going to go to... Uh, local disk C and now you can see your program files and other folders like this and usually here are the program data or um, not the data excuse me the program files a folder is where things are contained for games and programs but Need for Speed World is different as you can see there is electronic arts but for me it's just another game that I have so to get there you must type in what I typed in which would be C, the slash, and then um, uh, program data, which you should be able to see it better than I can. So, as you can see, here we are at many, many of your hidden program and game files. So, to get to Need for Speed World, what you must do is find the electronics folder. There we go, the electronic arts folder, Need for Speed World, and data. And then now, you have all the files from the game. Now, as you can see, you can edit anything you like, just don't change the name, and make sure to edit them while the game is already loaded, like when the play store. So here is where the cursors are located. Here are all the cursors from the game, like when you're modifying, and what's the skill, and you can't do things, you know, all those different cursors. Now, to use them, what you first must do is go back to the media folder. And now, right click the cursors folder, and then press send to the desktop, which will also say uh, create a shortcut, which I've already done that, so I'm just going to close that. And here you can see there is my shortcut. Now, to actually add them, what you must do is, I apologize, I was already here, but I was just showing you so you know where to locate it. So, you go up there to press on the personalization or whatever that says I can't really see it but either way you click that where I click right there and then go to personalization now you should see over to the sidebar change mouse pointer go ahead and click that sorry my computer's rolling a little bit slow alright now these are the settings that you have set for your mouse uh, pointers currently. You may change them, do whatever you like. But these are just my settings. They shouldn't be yours or if you've already modified them. It doesn't matter, they're yours. So if you want to add the ones from the world, what you must do is press browse and then find your um, cursor shortcut. I'm going to find mine here. Uh, here we go. And then choose the one that you want to use for the certain functions. Do whatever want you want. It's not my choice. It's completely your choice. Up to you. You get to choose to whatever you want to do. Which I already have a uh, custom setup set up. So I'm just going to cancel that. And then pull up my custom setup. And this is going to be proof that it works. So I pull up my custom settings. As you can see I have the cursors that I look for. The ones that I want in certain functions or whatever. And the default is just the one that I use for default in the game. And as you can see. There. That's the cursor from the game. 